Good afternoon, Hendon Prep. It is my honour and my privilege to introduce to you today the Cognita Home Games. Now, I'm going to show you some activities, and these are designed for years six and year eight only. If you're in another year, I have some videos, other videos for you to watch. So these activities are for year six and year eight only. I'm going to take you through some fitness activities today. This is stuff that you can do at home. It doesn't require any equipment. Alrighty, so activity number one is the one minute press up. Okay, press ups are notoriously hard to do. They're working your arms, they're working your shoulders, they're working your chest. Okay, they're also sort of working your core as well. And it's in, it's in, it's in, important to be able to attempt to do a press-up because it improves all of the strength up here. Okay, so in a minute, how many press-ups can you do? Now, let me just demonstrate quickly what a press-up looks like. I'm going to bring you down to here. So, there are two ways that you can do a press-up, guys. You could do it on your knees like that, okay, and you would come down and up on your knees. Okay, if you want to do a proper press-up or a full press-up, knees come up, bums down, Back nice and straight, and in one minute, how many press-ups can you do? Okay, now, like I said, press-ups are really hard, okay? The more, the more press-ups you practice, the better you will, will um, get at doing press-ups. If you can do 18 press-ups in a minute, wow, amazing. If you can do 26, amazing. If you can do more than 36 press-ups in one minute, okay, you're doing really, really well. Challenge yourself, okay, so that's number one. Okay, number two, the burpee test. Now, let me show you what a burpee looks like. It's very different to a burp, um, the burpee. So we start off standing like this. Make sure you've got enough space around you. You come down into a press-up position. You jump forward and then you jump up, okay? I'll show you that one more time. You come down, press up, jump forward, jump up, okay? Ah, that's your burpee, okay. So, if you can do 19 burpees, 19 of them in a minute, wow. If you can do 25 in a minute, double wow. If you can do more than 30 burpees in a minute, okay, so one every other second, you will be out of breath, fantastic, all righty? See how many of them you can do in a minute. Next one, the plank. Now the plank is really good for strengthening your core, okay? Your core is important for all kinds of sports, all right? So having a strong core, okay, your belly, will improve your ability to change direction, your ability to control a football, your ability to swim, your ability to um, be tackled playing netball or basketball, all of these things, if you've got a strong core, it'll help you. So you come into a presser position like this, then come down to your elbows like that. How long can you hold in this position for? You'll feel your stomach muscles starting to work, okay? How long can you hold it for? I'd probably struggle to hold it for the whole minute, okay? The world record, if you must know, is about eight hours for holding a plank. If you can do it, if you can hold a plank for more than 105 seconds, okay, so way more than a minute, you're doing really, really well. But start off aiming to hold a plank for the minute. Just hold it for the minute, hold it for half the minute, okay, and slowly build up. All right, that's activity number three. Number four is how many bounces can you do in 30 seconds? Now, like I said, for this, you don't need any equipment. Um, all I'm going to use for this is a cushion, okay, which I'm putting on the floor, all right? I'll put it on the floor like that. Good. And I'll bring you down so you can see what I'm doing. Okay, so for the bouncers, how many times, okay, can I jump over my cushion like that? I'll bring it back so you can have a right laugh at me trying to do this, okay? So you're trying to jump over your cushion or whatever it is, something soft, so if you land on it, it doesn't matter. So I'm going to see how many times I can jump over my cushion. And those are your activities. So just to recap, and you can go back and watch this video as many times as you want. Activity number one is the press up. 
Number two, the burpee. Number three, the plank. Number four, the speed bounce. If you can do 18 bounces in a minute, you're doing really, really well. If you can do more than 30 of jumping either side of a cushion, you're doing exceptionally well. Alrighty, I can't wait to see what you do. Take care, guys.